ahead and tell us what we're looking at here, David. Hey, uh, okay, we are the Society for Sustainable Mobility. My name is David Lee, uh, chairman of the group. Uh, we are a nonprofit organization trying to build a uh, brand new uh, platform from scratch uh, with the help of uh, volunteers around the world. Uh, as you can see, uh, this this SUV is actually, you know, in terms of interior size, is very similar to a Toyota Highlander with a performance of a Porsche Cayenne. Uh, so, so it's very marketable product. And if we can come over here, you can see some of the technology that we're using. Uh, for example, like a composite and aluminum mixed chassis, and uh, AC induction motors on uh, each wheel. Uh, it's liquid cooled. Um, what we're also very proud of is uh, this this plug and play power source module that we we have developed. Um, basically, what it is is a electrical generator that supplies energy to the rest of the car. Um, that allows you to use uh, different type of fuel sources. Uh, so you got a gasoline engine today, uh, but you want to use a diesel engine tomorrow, a biodiesel tomorrow, you can do that. Just go to the shop, and then they can swap it out for you in a couple of hours. So that really helps break down the, the, uh, the barrier to entry for a lot of alternative fuel businesses. Uh, as you can see here, also is some of the materials that, that, that we plan on using. For example, the, the transparent roof panel and the windows are all polycarbonate based, which is shown here. And it's a very glass-like material, except that it is, uh, you know, very light, a lot lighter than glass, and it doesn't shatter, uh, so it's a lot safer to keep with the occupants inside the vehicle during a crash, and it's very important. Uh, this is. Uh, another piece of material is a honeycomb uh, polyurethane uh, structure. Uh, right now this is cardboard, but uh, the, the production model will have a uh, more uh, sturdy uh, 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 honeycomb uh, insert. But basically we plan on using this as body panels on the car and, uh, and also uh, the floor pan uh, under, underneath the chassis. And as you can see, this is this is incredibly strong, but uh, on camera I can't show you how light it is, but this is really light. Uh, so that's, uh, that's the uh, material, and also uh, the most special part about this project is uh, because it's open source. What it means by open source is that if you go to our website, you can find all the you know, design data in a, in a uh, Wikipedia type system. Uh, something like that would be the electrical system, for example, and people can go in and make, you know, make comments and uh, you know, make this basically make this thing better and help it evolve. Um, our uh, design team, uh, we have two design teams. One in one in Los Angeles, who is uh, concentrating on the electrical system, uh, and we also have a design team in Rotterdam, Netherlands, who is. Uh, more focused on the uh, auto, uh, auto automotive engineering part of it, so the chassis and the suspension will be a European design, and uh, the uh, electrical system will be, will be designed in the, L, in the LA area with the help of a lot of uh, people in the aerospace industry. So, um, thank you. Cool. Perfect. Little walkthrough. It's as yeah. if they were here. Yeah. <laughs>